Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to add add-ons and plugins to Blender and how to enable them. So Blender is um, very versatile in what it can do and it is um, an open source piece of software, it's completely free and therefore um, it is very easy for people to develop assets for it or uh, plugins. Um, Plugins basically allow you to do very specific things within Blender or uh, add things to Blender that did not previously exist in the program. And through pub plugins, you can streamline a lot of the work you're trying to accomplish. So, um, say for example, I'm trying to create a bunch of books for a bookshelf, but I don't want to model all of the, the books. Well, there is a plugin that will do that for me. So the first thing I'm going to want to do is open up my internet browser and I went to the this plugin known as BookGen by Oliver uh, Westbarth, I hope I said that right. And um, on this website I can go and hit download and I've already downloaded it and once you've done that you can minimize your browser, go back to Blender, and I can go up to File. Uh, let's see, where is it? Oh, there it is. File, User Preferences, or I can also hit Control Alt U. Control Alt U opens up my Blender User Preferences, and here you have several tabs where you can make uh, changes to the to the software. However, we're going to go to the Add-ons tab, and Blender comes preloaded with some of the best add-ons that the Blender community has found useful, and they're all listed here. And so I would encourage you to go through the, this list of add-ons and enable some that just sound cool, or look them up and see what they do, and a lot of them will make Blender a, a much more user-friendly program where they'll allow you to do things that you couldn't do with the base program itself or it'll just make things easier such as BookGen. So I'm gonna come over to um, where it says install add-on I'm gonna click that and I'm going to go to my downloads and then BookGen and whenever wherever your file downloaded to it should be BookGen um, I'm on version 06 so whatever your version of book gen is when you see this video and it is a zip file just double click that file once you do that it is loaded into this list of add-ons and I can type in book gen and you'll see it appears right here if I enable that and save user settings and close then I can go and find out where book gen um, is located Let's see, I haven't actually checked that yet. Okay, so I found out where BookGen is located. If you hit Shift-A, it is located underneath your mesh drop-down. And that makes sense because you're, you're adding mesh to the scene. So I can go to Add Books. And then over in the Tool Panel, you'll see that I have a lot of different parameters that will allow me to um, edit these books. And this is what's amazing about add-ons, is instead of having to model these individually, I can go and um, just have this add-on create them for me. I would encourage you to just play around with the add-on. Um, go find more add-ons, just type in things you'd be interested to see if Blender does, and I, I guarantee you it there's probably an add-on for it. So use that knowledge to uh, begin to build up Blender to be a very personalized and unique program to you. See you in the next video.